Well, you know, when you get five scoreless innings out of Randy Vasquez, calling him up for his third major league start, and then hand a lead over to the bullpen with the best team ERA in the majors this season, you got to feel pretty good about your chances. But it did not work out for the Yankees in this one as they fall 6-3 to three to the Baltimore Orioles here at Yankee Stadium. Now, how did it happen? Well, let's consult our handy-dandy scorecard here. So, Three runs of the damage in the four-run Baltimore Six go to Nick Ramirez, who recorded just one out there, uh, gives up a RBI single to Colton Kowser that chased him. Now, that was Kowser's first Major League hit and his first RBI. And then Jordan Westberg greets Michael King with a line drive toward the gap in left center field. Jake Bowers closing in on it, racing hard for it. And as he's trying to time his dive, loses it in the lights. It rolls all the way to the wall. Isaiah kind of for had to go get it. And that was a two-run triple for Westberg. And Baltimore would later add a run there as Adam Frazier had an RBI ground out. Uh, yes, the bullpen melted down there. But let's talk about the fact that the Yanks bats did not really generate much traffic against Dean Kramer, who held them to... Uh, four hits, two runs, one earned over seven innings, a career-high 10 strikeouts for Kramer. Anthony Rizzo said his fastball seemed to be a couple gears up in this one as opposed to what they've seen before. Josh Donaldson, a uh, good sign there as he hits his ninth home run of the year. Uh, Kyle Higashioka later added an RBI single. But Yankees unable to generate anything else against Kramer. Uh, Anthony Volpe, chicken parm. Did come through with a homer in the eighth inning. That is his 12th of the year. And that is the most by a Yankee rookie. Remember, it's only, what, July 5? Uh, it's the most by a Yankee rookie since Mike Talkman, the sock man, hit uh, 13, I believe, in 2019. And then Mike Ford also had 12 in 2019. So Volpe, as long as he keeps eating the chicken parm, um, he, he should break both of those. And then we can uh, talk about Volpe chasing some other rookie records. Um, Billy McKinney reached on an infield single there in the eighth, and Anthony Rizzo gave the crowd here a throw with a deep fly ball to right field. Um, the crowd wanted it to go, and I thought momentarily that it might be, but Rizzo seemed to know off the bat uh, that it was not getting out, and that snaps his 19-game on-base streak. And uh, even though he has been getting on base, slugging percentage is low for those uh, that 20-game span there. I went and looked it up. It was under 300. So uh, Rizzo said just not hitting the ball, not producing the way uh, that he expects up to his career norms. And he said it's frustrating, but it gives me another opportunity to keep working. And so, uh, and then uh, the bullpen, I did say six runs off the bullpen. Ian Hamilton gave up a two-run homer in the ninth, and then the Yankees couldn't generate anything Further. So they drop this one here uh, back at it tomorrow as the Yanks and Orioles will conclude their four game series. That's the hokey pokey. That's what it's all about from Yankee Stadium. Almost said Baltimore. Uh, from Yankee Stadium, your final score once again is Baltimore six and the Yankees three. We'll see you tomorrow.